another word, you're out of this school. This show was a pop culture phenomenon, and it made you and the cast household names. How quickly did your life change, and how did you adjust to that level of fame? There's no easy transition from sleeping on the floor of your friend's apartment in the valley, in San Fernando Valley, and driving a $500 car you bought off of uh, uh, the penny saver, to, hey, you're going to be one of the leads of a, of a new, you know, show that happens to just happens to hit the zeitgeist and, and, you know, take off. When did you realize that you just weren't on a normal hit show, that this was a juggernaut? I had nothing to compare it to. I, I didn't even have, you know, most actors who, 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 who had the luxury of getting a hit show have done, you know, many, many years of work prior to that. So I was like, is this, this normal? This seems like it's going well, but I, I have nothing to compare it to. Is it going to be okay? <laughs> you know, um, it was a rock chip. And I think we all kind of hung on for dear life. Marissa, who was played by Misha Barton, dies in your arms at the end of this very season. How did you all react to the news that she was leaving the show? Yeah, it was odd. Uh, uh, very odd to leave, to, to, to have someone who was in it from the beginning leave. But, um, you know, it was, uh, it was dramatic in all the OC ways, uh, you know, car explosion and carrying her, her body from the, from the explosion. It, you know, it gave her a proper send off, hopefully, I guess is the way to say it.